did you guys wait to get in here? I have a question. Do you think they're ready for NAS or not yet? They don't sound ready at all. This doesn't sound ready at all. Are you ready for the big guy, Nas Daily, to come on stage? Nas, are you ready to come? Come, come, he's coming. Come on in style. Yo, 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 yo. I'm a vlogger, video creator. You can find me on YouTube. Yeah. Who knows me? Does anybody know me? Okay. Sweet. Take pictures later. I want to see you. Thank you. Thank you. Sorry. Okay. And you live in the Philippines. Oh, wow. Great. Thank you so much. Good to see you, dude. Who's next? I'm an Indian, so basically the typical boy. I love it so much, and I say what's up a lot, so what's up Tony, see you later alligator! Yeah! We have a baby on stage, please be careful, slowly, slowly, come in. Come in. Grab it for the baby. My name is Teresa Diana, I'm a beach head, I'm a red organizer, and I'm a mother of these two lovely boys. Go to the beach! Yeah! for you and you dance your proper style, okay? Okay, is anybody a beatboxer? Okay, here you go! First of all, thank you for coming. Uh, it is... I, I want to tell the same story. I'm sorry, because I love it. No, go for it. But it was messaging me, Come to the Philippines! Come to the Philippines! <laughs> I think I had, I had 280,000 followers uh, and, um, and I said, what the hell is the Philippines? I ne didn't know anything about it. I was ignorant, I still am. Um, and then I came here and I, people were so like excited, so energetic that I decided, why not have a meetup? This is a meetup, right? Yes. So I decided, why not try something new? It was 275 days already into Nas Daily. And I said, let's try something new and let's have a meetup. So I said, come to Starbucks by Manila Bay if you care about Nas Daily. And I thought nobody would show up. 4 p.m. came, nobody was there. And then 4.30 came, and then 40 people showed up. That was the first 40 people that came to a Nas Daily meetup out of like almost 50,000 people so far. And they came from the Philippines. And actually one of them was, actually was here, right? Sandy, he was one of the first people to come to the meetups. And we've been friends ever since. And when I saw that it was possible, it was possible to have a meetup and meet people in real life and talk about amazing things, I started doing it in any, every other country. So I did it in Japan, I did it in Thailand, I did it in America, I did it in Denmark, I did it in Israel. We did meetups everywhere and it has become sort of a signature 
uh, event. And now this is actually one of the biggest events we've had uh, also in the Philippines. Yes, clap for yourselves because you really delivered. So thank you guys for that. You inspire us in ways that you don't even know. Just like how the videos probably inspire you in ways that we don't even know, you are the reason uh, I am here. Oh, you're too nice. Thank you, thank you. Um, okay, first, for, first things first. Uh, I want to say thank you so much to the people that are hosting us here. This is not easy to find, okay? It's not easy to find a hall and a nice place uh, at Samsung Hall with the SMORA people. The Department of Tourism said, Nasdaily, why don't you come over and see all the stuff that we're doing and, and, and share it with your followers? And I said, sure, I'd love to come back. And so we went to El Nido, we went to Boracay, we went to Manila Bay, we went to Puerto Galera uh, to see how you guys are trying to protect nature. And I, I personally find it inspiring when you put something over money. Um, and I think we've enjoyed our time. It's, it's very good. impressive. And everyone talks about environment to us. It's like, it's like the future, the future arrived to Philippines about yeah. environment. And it's great to see that. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's amazing. So it, it, it kind of helps us. I, you know, it helps us become better people as well. Uh, so this is why we're here in the Philippines. The video will be out next week, next Saturday, because now it's no longer Nas Daily, it's Nas Weekly. Uh, <laughs> and then it's going to be Nas Monthly, and then it's going to be Yearly. Yeah, no, 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 no. That's not a life. <laughs> Nas wants a life. Nas Funeral. He said this thing was positive. Um, was this a good explanation? Is this a, is a valid explanation? Yes. In other words, thank you for allowing us to be here. Yes. Um, for free. All of us, no entrance fees. Really oh yeah, yeah, we we never charge for these things. Um, there's a, there's a lot of scams going around saying Nasty has a prize or whatever. And I, I never want to take money from you guys. We also have a book, but we're not selling it. Okay. We're, like, you shouldn't buy it, <laughs> in a way. You're a great advertiser, man. Thank you, thank you, sir. <laughs> Only buy it if you want, but definitely do not spend money in it if you cannot afford it. Um, That's a lot of people. Yes, a lot, yes, a lot, yes, a lot, yes, a lot. Yes, a lot, come up. Okay, it's okay. She has a Jovi already. This is awesome. We have vloggers on stage. I guess you guys need to say, what do you want to do? with these videos. <laughs> Everyone wants to go first. Let's start. Okay, let, me, let me give you an example, okay? Five word. Jopi would make life amazing. Oh, wow. Jopi for Nas, please. Wow. Share it down. <laughs> Sharing how Philippines is awesome! <laughs> okay. How to learn from us. What? How to learn from us. Um, okay, okay. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> thank you, thank you, man. Go. You help me create more. Oh. You for tomorrow. Oh. With Joby though? <laughs> Next person. It's all about that youth. I hope you inspired a lot, a lot of young people with this job. In. Send us your videos. You have to make videos with it, okay? Send us your videos. Uh, we're gonna make a video together. At the end of this, we're gonna we're gonna do we're gonna do like crazy stuff together, and it's gonna be really fun. It'll go on the Nas Daily page, okay? Tourists, did you know that tourists like us can be a problem? For the first time ever, I want to show you how one country in Asia is fixing the over-tourism problem. Say hello to... The Philippines! They went from this... to this. The Philippines has a long way to go, but they're trying. And we tourists also need to try to take nothing but photographs. Leave nothing but footprints and kill nothing but time. This good tourism is the future here in the Philippines and everywhere in the world. See you next week. Okay, uh, guys. 
the reason we're doing this is, you know, we, we shot all the video before. We just want the energy. And it's like so much better to get it with all these people. And everyone is going to be in the video, so keep an eye out for the video. Awesome. Um, all right. And I'm going to say, and everywhere in the world, and then everybody starts like making noise. Like, <laughs> and then I'm going to say, see you next week. Okay? So. Okay, you, you you understand what it means when I release the video, okay? Two, three, music is music! Thank you for doing this by the way. Stay hyper. I'm doing an eight-episode series, and the first opening episode is about the Philippines. So what we're gonna say. What we're gonna say is, I'm gonna say a hundred dollars in the Philippines because it's about what you can do with a hundred dollars, and I talk about how it helps tourism, it helps sustain local jobs. La 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 la. So three. A hundred dollars in the Philippines. Let's do one with them. Okay. Them and yeah. just do group one. No one needs to move because it's a panoramic. You're all in it. Okay. Okay, ready? Number one, two, three! Stay still, stay still, stay still, stay still, stay still. There's a lot of people here. Yeah. <laughs> Is it possible to play some music, baby?